know them for their classic cars, but now Volo Museum is much more. With 45 exhibits and 10,000 mechanical marvels, it's truly an experience for all ages. Marketing Director Jim White Dilla tells us what else you're going to find inside. I mean, it started as just an antique shop. They were just flipping old furniture. The two sons kind of tinkered with cars and started flipping cars. So after a while, they were getting this really cool collection of cars. And then about 20 years ago or so, they started adding the TV cars. You can see the Ecto-1 from Ghostbusters, or you can see the Back to the Future DeLorean or all these Dukes of Hazzard cars. So they're like, ooh, what else can we add to draw a different crowd in? And it's really anything mechanical. So they have snowmobiles, scooters, motorcycles. It's still all basically mechanical marvels, they call it. We dropped the name Auto out of Volo Auto Museum. Now it's, there's just so much more to it. about right when the pandemic hit, um, we've changed tremendously. So if you haven't been here in just a few years, it's changed tremendously. So behind me is a 1928 fully restored carousel. It took about two and a half years to restore this, about $2.5 million. We built this whole building around it. All of these street orchestras and self-playing pianos all work, basically transporting you back into Coney Island like 100 years ago. at Jurassic Gardens, which is like a 15,000 square foot animatronic dinosaur park where you can dig for dinosaur skeletons or pan for fossils. There's a theater in back. There's all kinds of cool stuff that you can do and learn about in this dinosaur exhibit. Then we have Modern Muscle. We're world famous for classic cars. We've been doing that for like 60 years, but we decided to broaden our horizons a little bit. So this is all cars 85 and newer. So it's Corvettes and Vipers and Lamborghinis and Mercedes and all kinds of really cool modern stuff that they have. We had an ice cream parlor. We have an in-house baker that makes treats. We have a gift store. We locally source pizza. It's an ADD wonderland and I love it. This museum is probably about 35 acres. We have another 35 acres next to us that we're gonna do train tours on. So there's helicopters and Batmobiles and trains and all the stuff out there. We've just completely upgraded the experience because now it takes a whole day to hang out here. There's really something for everyone. We have 45 exhibits now. So just even pre-pandemic, it was like 33. So there's a military museum, there's Disney displays, there's a SpongeBob car, there's campers that are just like 19, almost 100 years old. So I think there's just so much here for everybody. I just, I want people to like come out and see this because you'll just totally nerd out on all the cool stuff that they have. A lot of people didn't want to come up because they weren't car people. I get it, you know, and then the Hollywood cars added a different, now it's pop culture. Now there's something different there. And then from pop culture, just planes and trains and these beautiful Duesenberg cars and everything in between, these old vintage arcades that are like the very first gen arcades that kids can play. They can use tokens and play these, you know, 80 year old arcade machines. So it's, it's this really infectious energy that, you know, now all ages, not just car people can enjoy. We have a lot of gangster crime, and then we have a medieval torture museum next to it. There's All these are actual artifacts that were used at some point. They just come up with the coolest, so they have a V8 engine bar stool. We have an outhouse that's jet powered. It's an actual jet fueled, shoots flames. We have a snowmobile that's rocket powered. So it's probably the fastest thing we have. It goes like zero to 150 in like five seconds. We have a roller skate hot rod and a shopping cart hot rod. This is two story shopping cart that the guy sits on the top 15 feet up in the air and you can drive it around the fully functional piano hot rod. Like just really cool stuff that even if you have no interest in cars, it's just amazing to see these. I've been here a year and I'm still like finding stuff out and finding new things I didn't see yet. Be sure to grab your phones to scan the QR code on your screen and learn more information about checking out Volo Museum or head to their site, volofun.com. Listen to this, daytime viewers can get 20% off of admission by using the code DAYTIME20. I had not been there in a while, so I went up and, and shot this with our photographer, Bill. It is so cool there now. It, I mean, it was cool before, but I mean, there is so much more than I expected. Oh my goodness, I wanna go. Yeah. It's so awesome. I gotta get the kids up there this yeah, winter. Yeah, yeah, yeah.